What is up guys? This is Bullshot, back again with another Call of Duty Mobile video. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. So in today's video, I am gonna be covering the top 6 best assault rifles to use inside of the Season 11 Battle Royale. One thing I want to mention before I start the video. Which is, this top 6 list is going to be based only on those assault rifles, which are available as ground loots. So weapons like the AK-117 or the Peacekeeper is not going to be included in this video. Now, if this is your first time here in my channel, then be sure to press the subscribe button and turn on post notifications. I make some great tips and tricks videos and create some pretty powerful loadouts for the Battle Royale. And trust me, you don't want to miss out any of my custom builds. You can also follow me on Instagram and join my Discord server for exclusive tips and more awesome content. Links are provided in the description. Anyways, with that being said, let's get right into the video. Starting at number 6 spot, we have the M13, which is a mid-tier assault rifle, with super high fire rate and pretty decent recoil management and close to mid-range engagements. Although the overall damage range and the amount of damage per bullet is a bit low comparing to the other assault rifles. But if you're using the M13 only for close quarter battles, then you should not be having any sorts of problem with this weapon. The fire rate pretty much makes it up with the damage ratio in close range engagements. Here is the best custom gunsmith loadout of this assault rifle, which is highly optimized in short distance gun fights. Instead of using the large extended magazine, I have used the RTC magazine, which greatly increases the damage range and discards the sound of your shots. Also, this build has some great hip fire accuracy and it does a great job with the ADS engagements as well. So you can pretty much use this build as a hybrid choice of weapon. But I am gonna be suggesting you to carry something decent to take care of the long range engagements. Anyways, for the mods with this custom M13 build, I am recommending you to use the hipfire boost mods, the long range mods, and most importantly, the legendary variant of the extended magazine mods to get the best results possible. And now, coming at number 5 spot, we have the Krieg 6, which is another high tier assault rifle inside of the battle royale that has almost identical stats of the M4. This weapon has pretty moderate amount of damage and it is very easy to use in close to mid range engagements. The ADS bullet spread is extremely accurate and the overall recoil pattern is super easy to handle. Here are the best custom gunsmith builds of the Krieg 6, I have included the mythic variant with default iron sight, as well as the epic variant, which comes with the classic red dot sight. Performance wise, both of these two loadouts are pretty much the same, so you won't be able to notice the difference. Anyways, for the mods with this assault rifle, I am recommending you to use the extended magazine mods, the long range mods, and the precise shot mods to get the most effective results possible. Airdrop has been delivered. Be careful, Poltergeist is active. And now, coming at number 4 spot, we have the brand new M2, also known as the Janssen Rifle, which is a fully automatic assault rifle, with awesome firing control, and with a built-in low zoom optical attachment. It has a bit slower fire rate than the AK-47, but the damage per bullet is super reliable with the overall damage range. To be honest, this weapon almost feels like a cross between the Odin and the Swordfish MK2, and it delivers some insane performance if you use it properly. Although the default magazine is pretty low for a primary choice of weapon, so an enhancement to ammunition capacity is a must-have factor if you want to get full advantage of this assault rifle. Here is the best custom gunsmith loadout of the EM2, which is almost identical of my Krieg 6 build. I have increased the overall damage range and the bullet velocity, which will be super helpful for long-range engagements. And this build also comes with a large magazine and the classic red dot side attachment, which will make this build perfectly suitable for long-range battles. Anyways, for the mods with this custom EM2 build, I am recommending you to use the vertical recoil control mods, the precise shot mods, and most importantly, the extended magazine mods to get the most effective results possible. And now, coming at number 3 spot, we have the AK-47, which is currently one of the best long-range weapon available inside of the Battle Royale. I know some of my viewers may disagree with the fact that I've put this weapon above Krieg 6. First of all, it's just a personal preference, and trust me when I say, if you are focusing on the mid to long range engagements, then the AK-47 is slightly better option, and it is also pretty easier to use than the Krieg 6. You just need to get the proper combination of the mods, and you are pretty much good to go. 
Here are the best custom loadouts of the AK-47. The first one is my OG build, with a Ranger barrel attachment and built-in red dot sight, and the second one is built with a GRU grip combo and an external optical attachment. People mainly gonna be using this assault rifle for mid to long range distance, and these two loadouts have some great balance of damage range and ADS bullet spread accuracy, which are two main key factors for any long range weapon. Anyways, for the mods with this assault rifle, I am recommending you to use the extended magazine mods, the precise shot, or the long range mods, and the vertical recoil control mods, to get the best results possible. The revived flight will arrive in one minute. Now, coming at number 2 spot, we have the Kilo 141, which is a fully automatic assault rifle with an ergonomic design that improves the overall recoil management, and it comes with a steady fire rate, with some highly accurate ADS bullet spread for mid-range engagements. In Season 11, this assault rifle feels slightly more optimized than the Krieg 6 and the AK-47, and for a moderately skilled player, it can be a great choice to use this one as a primary weapon inside of the Battle Royale. Here are the best custom gunsmith loadouts for this assault rifle. The first one is designed for free-to-play users, which comes with an optical attachment. And the second build is based on the Mythic skin, which is almost similar, but I have used the OWC Laser Tactical, which will increase your ADS speed, reduce the bullet spread by a pretty decent amount, and the overall mobility of this loadout will be a little bit more optimized. Anyways, for the mods with this custom kilo build, I am recommending you to use the vertical recoil control mods, the precise shot mods, and most importantly, the extended magazine mods, to get the most effective results possible. And finally, coming at number 1 spot, we once again have the classic M4. This is currently a high tier assault rifle, with a pretty moderate amount of damage, and some insanely high accuracy for mid to long range engagements. This is also the most easy to use weapon, which has some awesome balance of mobility and recoil management. The recoil pattern of this assault rifle is by far the most optimized one, and the aim assist with this weapon is almost magnetic. The only downside of this weapon is the damage per bullet, which is slightly lower, comparing to the other assault rifles, like the Kilo 141 or the AK-47. Still, with the proper modification attachments, it can be a great choice for the assault rifle users, as it is extremely versatile to use in every possible ranges. Now, with the custom variant of this weapon, I am using the combination of monolithic suppressor and the marksman barrel, which is going to increase the overall damage range by a pretty significant amount. The stock will greatly help you to counter the flinch against your enemies. And for the optical attachment, I am using the classic red dot sight, but you can also use the 3x scope 2, which will give you pretty amazing results as well. Anyways, for the mods, I am recommending you to use the legendary variant of the long range mods, the extended magazine mods, and the precise shot mods, to get the most optimized results possible. Anyways, that's basically it for today's video. I hope you have enjoyed today's contents. It would be greatly appreciated if you drop a like and share this with your teammates. And if you are new here, then don't forget to press the subscribe button and turn on post notifications. I upload some pretty helpful tips and tricks videos and make some pretty powerful gunsmith loadouts for the battle royale. And trust me, you don't want to miss out any of my custom build. Follow me on Instagram and join my Discord server for exclusive tips and more awesome content. Links are provided in the description. Alright then, have a great day. I'll catch you at the next one with another new amazing video for the battle royale. Till then, take care. Bulls out.